My name is Keith Ryder. I live in Wheaton, Illinois. I've been coming out to Garfield Farm for five or six years to do my little living history camp. I'm representing a, an 1849 gold rushed immigrant, someone on the way from Illinois to California to make their fortune. I've been doing living history for about 35 years. I did Revolutionary War and Civil War for a long time. Uh, right now I play several weekends a year in a Revolutionary War military band. I'm retired from the Army Corps of Engineers in Chicago. My title was archaeologist. I was also sort of a historian there and I've been interested in Midwestern uh, history for a long time and Garfield Farm gives me an opportunity to trot out the uh, 1840s equipment and talk to the public about what it was like to live back then. Well what I've got set up is a camp of a typical educated fairly well-off person who's decided for one reason or another to go to California around 1850 and I've been reading the the guidebooks from the period and you can see I've got a whole slew of armament ready to deal with bandits or Indians or to cause gun accidents on the trail which is what happened. I happen to be a musician so I've brought my key bugle and Ophiclide. If I were a carpenter in Illinois I might make two dollars a day but if I can get to San Francisco I could make 15 or 16 a day playing my instruments in a body house or saloon or casino or a theater. And everything I've got is typical of late 1840s. There's a lot of people who have never seen a, a percussion shotgun or a keyed bugle. And most of these things are in functioning shape and I can demonstrate them and they, uh, they're good conversation starters. Visitors who come uh, like to see my camp set up. They find my clothes and glasses amusing. I get mixed reactions to my musical abilities. I've got some little informational posters set out with uh, cost of living, uh, what it costs to get yourself to California, how people got there, how long it took. You'd be surprised how many people have a story of some ancestor who went to California or they're reminded of a, uh, a shotgun that hung over their uncle's uh, <laughs> fireplace when they were a kid. I enjoy my visits to Garfield Farm. It's a unique setting. The western suburbs have not engulfed this little spot yet. There's really nothing like it in the Chicago suburbs. It gives me an opportunity to trot out my historical items and to learn more about uh, local history. It always sends my blood pressure down to where it should be. It's a beautiful spot uh, and I hope you enjoy your visit here. <laughs>